We're gonna talk about Blockchain Development Ultimate Guide 2022 update. I have with me Josh here. Hi Josh, how are you? I'm good, thanks for having me again, Rob. Thank you, let's dive right into it. Let's start with the blockchain trends that 2022 bring. Yeah, actually in 2022, there's a lot of new use cases that emerge for the use of blockchain technology. So it actually has progressed into different industry, especially with the use of NFTs. NFTs has changed the landscape of blockchain use. Some of, of the application that I've seen so far this year that's coming up is in gaming. Uh, we have a lot of use cases for music distribution, real estate ownership, the metaverse, which is uh, another topic that we can discuss in the future, and a lot more. All right, and then uh, Solana and Polygon. Yeah, so we've discussed a um, few days, I mean, a few weeks back about um, smart contracts and blockchains. And one of the topics that was um, covered was Solana blockchain and Polygon. So Solana and Polygon are two projects that are made to address the issues rising from the high transaction fees of the Ethereum network. Um, while Solana is a layer one blockchain that offers you very low gas fees and can process a whooping 50k transaction per second, it's also um, a good alternative uh, to Ethereum. Polygon, on the other hand, is a layer two solution which addresses the same concern but has more compatibility with the Ethereum ecosystem. So most of the time, um, developers would prefer uh, the Ethereum ecosystem the Ethereum ecosystem, which is more supported by the Polygon Layer 2 solution. However, as mentioned in the previous podcast, Solana is also gaining popularity. So it's also, I think, more of a personal preference in these days which network you would choose, but both indeed have their own advantages over using a Layer 1 blockchain. And, shoot. and then how to hire a blockchain development team. So this is actually a very intriguing, um, intriguing topic, right? So because of the popularity of blockchain technology, a lot of developers have emerged in the market. You can see um, most of them um, in different uh, freelancing platforms and then different job hiring uh, platforms. However, majority of these developers lack experience and skills because um, blockchain is a fairly new technology. So to be able to develop the best solution, you need to evaluate a development team or develop a company, development company and make sure that the team has a, first has a profound understanding of blockchain technology, including the aspects of interoperability, cryptography, and software architecture. So we can actually give you some of the basic steps on how to evaluate uh, blockchain development. Um, first off, um, based from this article that we have here, you need to find out if the developer knows about basic programming concepts, right? So basic programming concept is a must have for any developer or any development team. They need to know what OOP is, syntax, which are treading those basic terms. And then that's one of the first keys to be able to differentiate an experienced team over um, over a team that has less experience in the blockchain technology. Second, um, you need to find out if the developer understands security needs of blockchain technology. Blockchain being a fairly new technology has its own security concerns. They need to understand terms like secure hashing algorithm or SHA, encryption, pri private and public keys, and other security terms. Third, um, they need to understand data structures. So one of the one of the things that an expert usually have versus those beginners in this particular industry is having a good understanding of data structures. Since blockchain itself is composed of multiple multiple data structures like linked list, hash tables, etc., it's a good thing that the development team or the developer that you are hiring know and understand these concepts. Fourth, uh, you need to inquire, right? Whether a developer knows the basic concept of blockchain. 
course, if you need the best solution in blockchain, that person or that team needs to know the concepts behind it. Concepts like distributed ledger technology, immutability, token creation, uh, decentralized application or dApps. These are just a few things that you need, uh, you need your team to have before they can build a be the best blockchain solution. And lastly, of course, you need to know if the development team or the developer knows the right tools to use. So there are popular um, tools that use that is being used on blockchain development, namely uh, Composer, Explorer, Remix, MetaMask, the Ed Ether Scan, yeah, Mist, Caliper, and for the Bitcoin, if you are building on a Bitcoin, it's a Bitcoin blockchain explorer. So in a nutshell, there's a lot of steps to take for you to find the best team, but you can use these steps that we gave you to be able to find out or hire the best blockchain development team out there. So yeah, that's pretty much it, uh, Rob. Thank you very much. Thank you so much, George. I hope this is going to be useful for our audience. And uh, George, I see you next time. And thanks everybody for listening. Bye-bye. Bye-bye.